Uh, Alright, greetings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire and welcome to more Dragon Warrior Monsters. How do you do? I am the Guardian here. My name is Duran. You have good eyes. You're with pretty good monsters. I see you're somebody! I wonder if you're good enough to fight me. Let me see how you fight. Come on! My servants! Now this is in the Gate of Reflection. Here, fight to your heart's content. This is the end of the Gate of Reflection. I took the liberty of doing it all off screen. Alright, so let's give them a white fire, a scorching, and another scorching. It's gonna open up with a blizzard. It's gonna open up with another blizzard. You need to be very careful. You need to fight three monsters in a row. Well, three fights in a row without any chance to heal in between. And Arts just lost a few HP. White fire. Uh, heal all to ACDC. And Mega, you do another Scorching. This boss can be a little hard because, you know, there are so many of them. Alright, well, there's one. Now if we come back to the Gate of Reflection, we won't have to fight those. Ha <laughs> ha ha! You defeated them easily. Forgive me for having you fight with weaklings. The next one is a pretty tough one. It's a swordman who wandered in here in search of the best sword in the world, and at last came to me. Come on out! This scene plays exactly like it did in Dragon War Quest VI. Let me introduce him to you. He's the one who dedicated his soul to me. And he's the strongest in all the world, Link. Come on, Link. Fight to your heart's content. Show how strong you are. It's our future selves. Terry! To anyone who's played Dragon Warrior Monsters, you know exactly who that guy is. Alright, heal all. Heal all. Defend. Yeah, you see, we're gonna kinda need to stick at full health. No! Well, we're actually now completely fucked, because... Well... Put it simply, now we don't have enough HP to do anything. If he gets the first move, I'm going to try to lay a curse on him. But I'm not expecting to actually beat him. In fact, I kind of expect this episode to take place over many days of filming. Nope. Oh, what? Uh, it's because I was too quick on the fucking button. Well, uh... That's that. Makes me wish I had a bookmark I could have dropped there, but honestly, there wasn't much I could do. The only thing you can do if you faint is go all the way back in there, all 28 floors. So I'll come back when I can actually get all the way back. Ha <laughs> ha, you came again. You want to fight? I'll give you a real fight. Come out, you dedicated assault to me. Alright, I can't really talk too loud because there's a lot of other people in the house currently, and I'm... But I want to record, so I'm just going to stay a tad quiet. Alright, so let's try this again. And I'm sorry for that outburst of uh, quite foul language towards the end of the last episode. That wasn't very... Becoming of me. <laughs> Toss a curse on. So he's going to open up with Rain Slash like he did last time. But ACDC can turn into Terry. However, ACDC is also poisoned, so... Crap. Try to drop his defense a little more. His Evil Slash, Bolt Slash, and Rain Slash. Evil Slash is the best damage dealing option, but since it has such low accuracy, I'm gonna give it a miss. Wow, that was kinda close. I mean, the cool thing is, I have 10 world leaves because I came into some good fortune on the way here. So, I don't really have much to worry about. So, I'm just going to toss a blaze most his way. Terry starts dancing. Alright, well, he seems to be the lowest defense possible, so... 
go for Bi Attack. Oh yeah, by the way, I got rid of, um, I bred off Mega with a Medusa Eye, and I got an Orochi, which I called Hero. Which I actually wanted to call Quinn, but for some reason I called it Hero. Now, for some reason, he's gonna stick to attacking ACDC the most out of anyone, so... Just go wild. However... Well, he just lost that much HP. However, uh, I don't have a whole lot of MP left. Because I uh, ran into a lot of misfortune on the way here. Like, the quest started out great, but... <laughs> it didn't end out great. So yeah, by attack is the precursor to quad hits, which is something we very much want. However, poor grammar that may have sounded. And you have to stay on the top of your game when it comes to predictions. Or else, uh, you die. <laughs> So there we go, we knocked out Terry. Now to anyone who's played Dragon Quest VI, this scene should be very familiar. Ha ha ha! How easily you defeated such a brutal opponent! You're not bad, you're my kind of fighter. To have such a fighter so near? Thrilling! What a coward. Now the ultimate monster in the game? You want a real thrill? Fight me! Satisfy my bloodlust, taste my steel, fight! The strongest monster in the game, Dark Dream, is a palette swap of Duran. Alright, so we're going to try to use the same strategies we did last time. Drop his defense. Transform. And heal all to ACDC. Oh my god. That did a lot of freaking damage. Fortunately, I also have some world dues, so I will be using that on us. Whew. I'll be right back. Yeah, sorry, someone just walked in. Okay, so let's drop his defense again. What do we have? Track slash, bird blow, and vacuum. Just attack. And drop a curse. Ooh, that's a uh, pretty scary skill. Yeah, but now he's low. Oh, so low. So, just start dropping him with attacks like this. Cast heal all on arch, and let's go. <laughs> One HP. Boss fight's made easy. <laughs> Heal all on Arch. However, he's only got one more heal all left in him, so... I'm gonna save it for when we need it. So, another round of that, and that might actually do it. Nope, there goes Hero. <laughs> but that's okay, because I have all these world leaves. You get 10,000 experience. I love how ACDC levels. D did I lose? I lost. You fought masterfully. I was utterly defeated. I didn't think a monster master of your caliber existed. Look, I'm still shaking from the excitement. 
He wasn't like that in Dragon War Quest 6. You're strong. You even defeated him. I couldn't beat that guy. I mocked you, calling you a coward. Someone who can't even use a sword. I take it back, you're invincible. Even without a sword, you're the best fighter. What's your name? It's okay, I know. <laughs> For some reason, I feel relieved. It's morning, time to wake up. So long, Link. Will we meet again? Maybe we shouldn't. Let me give you some advice. Don't become like me. Farewell, Link. I'm taking off. Take care of your sister, no matter what. Let's go back. No snarky comment. Oh well. Link, how was it? What lies in your future? <laughs> Prepare yourself and rest your monsters. The starry night is coming soon. The whole kingdom is excited. Link and companions slept off their fatigue in the stable. And the day breaks. Oh, King. Regardless, you've worked very hard. Both the people of my kingdom and I trust your ability. You will bring glory to Great Tree. It's up to you now, Master Link. Well, there we go. Well, well, here's a hero, by the way. He's an Orochi. You get him by mixing a, a pretty any, any high-level dragon with uh, a Medusa. Eye. Now, there's only one thing left to do in the game, and that's the Starry Night Tournament, which I will cover in the next episode. So, see you guys then.